Hardcore Minecraft is the only version of Minecraft where you can actually die by starvation. And in the last episode, we were slowly running out of food. So I thought, what better way to ensure we don't starve than building the world's largest carrot farm? Oh, and we'll also be making some serious progress. Anyways, be sure to like the video, and let's get straight into episode 2 of Hardcore Minecraft. Alright guys, welcome to episode 2 of Hardcore Minecraft. And to be fair, nothing has really changed from episode 1, apart from I put these flowers over here just to make the area look a bit nicer. Oh, and it looks like it's night already, so we better sleep before the rest of the episode. But anyways, as you know from the intro, today we're going to be building the world's largest carrot farm. And I have a vision that this carrot farm is going to cover this entire area. But for that, we're going to need a lot of carrots. So we better have a look in our chest to see how many we've got to start with. Ah, that might be a problem. Oh well, I guess we got to start somewhere. We better get these carrots planted first. I think we'll start them just here. Alright, this is going to be a very, very long task. So we're probably going to spread it out throughout the episode as we're making some normal progress. Yeah, we're definitely running dangerously low on food. I've only got this four steak and one apple that I don't really want to eat. So we should probably go get some. Hello, cow. I was about to try and kill that horse for food. Ooh, a nice little lava pool. Hmm, at some point in this series, we're definitely going to have to do something in the desert. Looks like a pretty cool area to build. Ah, yes, more cows. Hmm, actually, while we're here, we might as well check the village for some carrots. Oh. Okay. All right, we've got five now. All right, we're going to need to cook this food, just like old times. It's hard to tell what's carrots and what's beetroot sometimes. There's a carrot, potatoes, beetroot. I hate beetroot. I feel like I'm saying it weirdly. Beetroot, beetroot, beetroot. Anyway, let's go plant these 16 carrots and get them growing so we can get more carrots. That'll be very awesome. And then I think we're going to have to try and start a cow farm of some sort because we want to get some enchanting going. All right, we have a start. From these carrots, this entire area will be covered in carrots. You will be standing on carrots. All right, I know this episode is about carrots, but we're definitely gonna have to get some sort of wheat farm going as well. Ah, our first cow. There we go. Come here, cow. Follow me, I have wheat. Ah, uh, no. All right, good. I will leave you with a crafting table. And I've spotted my second cow. All right, cows, you can stay there with the crafting table. Look after it. You're not getting another one if you break it. Check on the carrots. Oh, they are so green. Let's just have a look how long it takes for carrots to grow. Yeah, that is not good. All right, we're going to be here for a long time. So while we're waiting for the carrots to grow, I'm going to get some stuff done. Ooh, a desert temple. I think we've got time to check out the desert temple just before night. Let's be careful and let's be quick. Oh my god, that's a ravine. And more sugar cane. All right, that was kind of scary. Depth strider 2, that's kind of boring, but saddle. Awesome, that adds a lot of bones. That's going to make this episode a whole lot easier. Um, is that sand block good? These bones are going to be very useful. In fact, I'm probably going to use some of them right now. We'll use some just to get our wheat levels up. And of course, the rest on the carrots. I'll update you guys once I finish bone mealing all of these carrots. Alright, so we now have over 100 carrots and we have some planted as well. So let's get planting. Oh, it destroys crops. No.
Alright, so at the moment, the carrot farm is looking pretty promising. We've made some nice progress, but we've definitely still got a lot more to do. Alright, we have two wheat, so we can breed the cows. And as if by magic, we now have three cows. I want a horse. Ah, there we go. First try. Jeez. All right, me and my horse are now matching. Let's see if the horse is actually any good. Well, they're actually pretty fast. I think this is pretty fast for a horse. Let me know in the comments, guys. Is this good for a horse? Can it jump high? Um, the answer to that is no. It can jump a little bit. Oh yeah, I completely forgot about picking up the food that we cooked at the blacksmith, so let's go get that. There we go, now we won't starve. Everyone knows that carrots are the best food, right? Alright, now we've got this little bit of food, we might as well just go exploring for a little bit. Ah! Ah! They hurt. This is pretty scary, actually. I am gonna go back. Ah, oh, there's mobs everywhere. All right, guys, we are back from our adventure and my horse is quite injured, as you can see. So we really need to work on this wheat farm so we can get him some health back. But on the good side, the carrots are growing and we have some sugarcane to harvest. Excuse me for a second. Wait, where are our diamonds? Did we leave them in the other chest? Ah, here they are. All right, we're gonna transport all this stuff to the new house. Okay. We have all our stuff and let's turn three of these diamonds into our first ever diamond pickaxe. Perfect. Okay, and now it's time to get some obsidian. All right, we wanna make this as safe as possible. So we're probably gonna put the water there and then get mining some obsidian. So here's an entertaining time-lapse of me mining obsidian. All right, we've got enough obsidian for now. And there we go, our first enchanting table. Now where to put it? Uh, that's not really a good place, so we'll just put it down here for now. All right guys, so I've just came back from being AFK for a little bit, having some dinner and stuff, and I got myself a nice Diet Coke. So listen to this. Ooh. Anyways, because I was AFK and I didn't turn my computer off, all the carrots have grown, so that's pretty epic. But I'm just worried there might be a creeper. All right, no creepers. We're all good. All right, so the wheat has grown, so let's quickly breed the... Ah! Oh my god. Plant some more seeds. Okay, time to plant some more carrots. There we go. All the carrots have now been planted. I think once this grows, we should have nearly enough to cover this entire area. But in a minute, I think it's time to try and get some more mining done and try and get ourselves full diamond armor. But first, I think I'm going to continue tilling this dirt so we'll be able to plant the carrots really easily. So I'll see you when it's done. Okay guys, we're back and I've spent the last hour right clicking dirt blocks. As you can see, I've been quite busy. Now all that's left to do is plant the carrots once they're fully grown. Once they're fully grown. So now I think it's time to take a break from the carrots and let's see if we can't get ourselves full diamond armor. Well, that's not good. Ah! Okay. Okay, this time I think we're gonna go straight into strip mining and we're gonna find a place to start a mine. This place seems all right for a mine. I think Y level 11 works best for me. I'm not sure. Let me know in the comments what you guys do where you're strip mining in Minecraft. I think I'm probably gonna watch some Rick and Morty. Oh, 
Let's go! We found some diamonds. And I was watching Rick and Morty while it happened. This cave looks kind of cool. Yay! More diamonds. Let's go! One, two, three. Surely there's got to be diamonds here. Oh, yes there is. Ooh. I've actually never really seen one of these in, in 1.17 yet. Oh, I love the noise. Oh, they're so satisfying to break as well. <laughs> Alright guys, as you can see, we've now got enough diamonds to make ourselves full diamond armor. So let's head back to base. Alright, so we now have ourselves full diamond armor and we're definitely going to enchant it soon, but maybe not in this episode. However, when I was mining, I did have a really good idea. At the start of each episode, I'm going to plant a carrot for every 100 subscribers we've gained since the last episode. So if you want to make the carrot farm even bigger, don't forget to subscribe. And yes, I was inspired by Wadzi's melon farm. Anyways, let's get planting. Alright, and we are officially out of carrots, so we're going to have to wait for all of these guys to grow again before we can complete the rest of the carrot farm. Oh, I think we're probably about halfway there, maybe just a bit less. Anyways, in the meantime, let's get working on an enchanting table. Yay, more cows! Oh yeah guys, don't forget to suggest a name for the horse and I'll be sure to name him in the next episode. Right now we are just on a search for leather though so we can make some more bookshelves. Ah, the turtle colony from episode 1. I'm just going to run AV you a little bit. Four more pieces to go and we have a full level 30 enchant table. Okay, it looks like this horse is going to be our last piece of leather. <laughs> looks like this cow is going to be our last piece of leather. Yes, there we go. Perfect. And bang. I'll just chuck this here for now. And now we have a level 30 enchant table. Protection 4 helmet. Protection 4. Okay, just protection 4. Alright guys, so I've basically just got to wait for this carrot farm to grow now. And I think instead of just doing nothing and chopping down some trees, I'm probably going to make my horse a house because right now he's just chilling on top of my base. So sit back and relax and enjoy a horse house building montage. Alright guys, as you can see, the horse house is now complete. Now we've just got to find the horse to put him in it. I haven't seen him in a little bit actually. I have no idea where he could be. Surely he couldn't have gone that far. Have you seen him? <laughs> Gonna take that as a no. <laughs> Look at him trying to hide. There he goes. Look, you've even got your nice little bed with your favorite color. And some wheat that you can't eat, you just have to look at, okay? Okay, so the horse is happy, now let's go check up on the carrots. I think they might need a few more minutes, so we'll skip to then. Alright guys, so it has been many minutes since I last spoke to you, and the carrots have now completely grown. 
So that means it is time to farm the carrots. Alright guys, as you can see, all the carrots have been collected. Uh, wait a second. Alright, there we go. All the carrots have been collected now, and I'm just going to do some quick math to work out how many carrots we actually have. I'll be right back. So, 9 times 7. Alright guys, I have reached the carrot verdict, and it turns out we have 4,317 carrots. <gasps> That's a lot of carrots. So finally, the last thing we need to do is plant all of the carrots again, and then by the start of next episode, they'll be ready to harvest. And here we go. Oh, finally. Okay, so the giant carrot farm is complete, and that concludes the end of this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please remember to like and subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Goodbye.